anytime, anywhere. ABC. We have contestants who will sweat it out for a chance to win 50 large. Out, everyone. All right, let's see what the qualifier's looking like for our contestants. This is an easy one. Should be a walk in the park for him, Johnny. And here we have the smack wall sweeper. Smacking and sweeping? Oh, where do I sign up? Say hello to our old friend, the big balls. And there is nothing left to say, except thank you. Here we have the leap of faith. Dishing out wipeouts, I can really believe it. Let's check in with the third member of our team, Jill Wagner. Here I am with Jebediah Shiner, who actually took his car off center blocks to get here today. Jump up when you're ready to begin. have excess majorly wipes out our big ball. They are spears that delight me, Johnny. Majorly wipes out on our big balls. They are spears that delight me, Johnny. Look who's talking. Our 
player heads straight into the water. Have a drink. It's an honor. Oh. Missed it. What a hit. Brings a smile to my face and a song to my heart, Johnny. <laughs> and Jebediah Shiner finishing with what can only be described as Mediocre time. Nothing to ride home to the trailer about. Contestants will compete on our eliminator round. Say hello to the dreaded sweeper. Yeah, bad for them. Great for us. Let's check in with the third member of our team, Jill Wagner. Jump up when you're ready to begin. Let's take a peek at what the bruise ball has for our players. Kid stuff, Johnny, kid stuff. Just like baseball, bruise ball has four bases. Contestants must pass each base and make it to home plate in order to win. They must run down the first base line, pass the mound, and make it to first base. All the while, though, they have to avoid the swinging bruise ball bats. Once safely on the base, they'll have to make it to second along our bouncing base path. To get to third, they'll have to take a walk down the slide walk. And to score a run, they have to dive head first and touch home plate. And the third member of our team, Jill Wagner, is down on the sideline. Jump up when you're ready to begin. <laughs> Grab Johnny. Man. And Jebediah Shiner finishing our course with a terrific shot. I think this officially makes him the most successful person in his family. The wipeout zone is coming up after the break. Let's take a look at our wipeout zone. I like it so much, I can tell I'm gonna like what I see before I even see it. Uh, gotcha. Say hello to the spiked whackers. And be polite or they will flip out. Here's a little something we call the piston punch. It hits first and asks questions later. Let's go to the third member of our team, Jill Wagner, who's with our contestant now. Jump up when you're ready to begin. Ah! Ah! Well, that piston punch ball couldn't have felt good. Yeah, I think you may have some ah! internal combustion.
sir. That was right to his legs, Johnny. Well, that's one way to get a leg up on a contestant. And our contestant grabs a ring. They're more valuable than my nanny's porcelain figurine. And Jebediah Shiner finishing our course with a terrific time. I think this officially makes him the most successful person in his family. Hey guys, I'm here with our big $50,000 winner, Jebediah Shiner. I think he's found his new talent. It was a nail biter, Johnny, but there can only be one winner. Well, you're always a winner in my book, John. For John Anderson and Jill Wagner, I'm John Henson saying good night and big balls. Hello, America, and welcome to Wipeout. Today, one of our ordinary Americans is walking away with $50,000. They have to take on the biggest obstacle course ever assembled. Hello and welcome to Winter Wipeout, where we're sitting back in our slippers with a steaming hot cup of cocoa and chilling out with some cool wipeouts. I can't imagine our contestants are that relaxed. All right, let's see what the qualifier's looking like for our contestant. This is an easy one. Should be a walk in the park for him, Johnny. This is a little trip to Nana's house. It's a winter wonderland gone horribly wrong, Johnny. In the sweeper trees, contestants run along, avoiding rotating rods that cross their paths. But more often than not, being swept into the drink below. Here's a winter classic, the Yule Log Jam. Feel the burn, Johnny. Let's see what Jill Wagner's up to down on the course. Hey guys, I'm here with Angelica Bell, who says she'll win today because she always gets what she wants. Spoil the alert. Jump up when you're ready to begin. Straight to the leg. Our course doesn't discriminate, John. Ooh. 
Our contestant cannot be liking this. But luckily for me, I do. Look at this, our contestant gets a ring. It's like a secret stash that everyone knows about. And it looks like Angelica Bell is delivering a fantastic time. Interestingly, the girl who never worked for anything really worked it out there. Coming up next, the Eliminator Round. Contestants will get their tickets here for the ski lift. I am looking for some spectacular falls on Mount Wipeout. And the third member of our team, Jill Wagner, is down on the sideline. When you're ready to start, jump. Wow, a good hit there for the sweeper. Good? I would think she might call it bad. Say that? Hold on, give me a minute to reset. Let's check out the ice arena, shall we? This looks tough, Johnny, and cold. We'll see if our players are up for the challenge. Here we have the dizzy dummy. Don't call me dummy, Johnny. This is the crankshaft. All those arms aren't for hugging, Johnny. This little obstacle is the knee sweeper. Our contestant is at the top of the course and ready to go. So let's check in with Jill and get the scoop. When you're ready to start, jump. Angelica Bell comes in with an extraordinary time on our court. With the tiara still intact, that is impressive. It all comes down to this, the wipeout zone. Let's take a look at our wipeout zone. I like it so much, I can tell I'm gonna like what I see before I even see it. Uh, gotcha. Say hello to the mega big balls. Just like the original big balls, except with more real wipeout action. Here we have the wheel and deal. Think of it as the wheel of misfortune. This obstacle is the sinister snowflakes. With zero holiday spirit, this one's a real Grinch, Johnny. We have a contestant ready to go, and the third member of our wipeout team, Jill Wagner, gets us the story. Jump up when you're ready to begin. <laughs> Forecast partly cloudy with 150 minutes of white.
like that. The big balls rarely disappoint. You don't scratch that. Never disappoint. by fear. Angelica Bell is delivering a fantastic time. Interestingly, the girl who never worked for anything really worked it out there. Our winner is Angelica Bell, and guys, she is thrilled to have another notch in her tiara. Not to mention the $50,000 cash prize. Another epic game of Pratt Falls and missteps. Or, as I like to call it, another day at the office. Alongside John Anderson and Jill Wagner, I'm John Henson saying good night and big balls. Hello, America, and welcome to another refreshing episode of Wipeout. They'll have to make it through the toughest challenge since finding a date for my senior prom. Thanks again, sis. Hello and welcome to Wipeout. We mock people so you don't have to. And that just makes for a kinder world, John. Let's take a look at the qualifier. Come on, it's easy. My Nana could do this one. Here's everyone's favorite, the big balls. Oh yeah. Along with their loving friend, the motivator. And here we have the trampoline sweeper. They are back and more bouncy than ever. Here we have the leap of faith. Dishing out Wipeouts, I can really believe it. Let's see what Jill Wagner's up to down on the course. We're here with, oh, um, ugh, I can't read the name. So let's just say contestant number one, shall we? Jump up when you're ready to begin. Ah, oh, missed it. Look out below. Literally, this contestant needs to start doing Ouch! Look out below! Literally, this contestant wants to start doing Did you say that? Hold on, give me a minute to reset.
Ricky A finishing our course with a great time. All I can say is... <laughs> Coming up next, the Eliminator Round. Say hello to the dreaded sweeper. Yeah, bad for them, great for us. Let's check in with the third member of our team, Jill Wagner. When you're ready to start, jump. <laughs> Let's take a peek at what the bruise ball has for our players. Kid stuff, Johnny, kid stuff. Just like baseball, bruise ball has four bases. Contestants must pass each base and make it to home plate in order to win. They must run down the first base line, pass the mound, and make it to first base. All the while, though, they have to avoid the swinging bruise ball bats. Once safely on the base, they'll have to make it to second along our bouncing base path. To get to third, they'll have to take a walk down the slide walk. And to score a run, they have to dive head first and touch home plate. Let's check in with the third member of our team, Jill Wagner. When you're ready to start, jump. <laughs> Dinky 8 gets a great time. I have to say, I'm surprised. It's coming up the moment we've all been waiting for, the Wipeout Zone. Let's take a look at our Wipeout Zone. I like it so much, I can tell I'm gonna like what I see before I even see it. Uh, gotcha. Say hello to the Mega Big Balls. Just like the original Big Balls, except with more real Wipeout action. This is the Crankshaft. All those arms aren't for hugging, Johnny. Adding to today's carnival is the spin-out. You must be this tall to ride this ride. We have a contestant ready to go, and the third member of our Wipeout team, Jill Wagner, gets us the story. Ready to play? Jump up. A huge missed punch Wipeout. I have a feeling this contestant didn't enjoy that So it goes. Down into the drink. Enjoy it. I know we will. That was a great wipeout partner. Oh yeah, I think I just found my motivation. Ouch! Our player takes that one right in the melon. Wow, talk about a headache. Straight to the head. <laughs> I'm sorry, is it wrong to laugh? There you have it. Our contestant could not be liking this. But luckily for me, I do. Not good. 
good. Our player takes that one right in the melon. Wow, talk about an edit. It looks like it's the year of the dinky ape. I'm here with our big $50,000 cash prize winner. Spills, chills, and thrills are now over, Johnny. Not so fast, my friend. We still have to drive home. Alongside my partners, John Anderson and Jill Wagner, I'm John Henson saying good night and big balls. Hello, and welcome to a new episode of Wipeout. They'll have to face the... Hello, everybody, and welcome to Wipeout. It's time for people to get punched, hit, and smashed. And that's just in the green room. Now it's time to check out our qualifier. I'm ready, but I'm not sure our contestants are. Welcome to the Blenderizer. May cause dizziness and vomiting. Say hello to our old friend, the Big Ball. And there is nothing left to say, except thank you. Here we have the leap of faith. Dishing out wipeouts, I can really believe it. Our contestant is at the top of the course and ready to go. So let's check in with Jill and get the scoop. We're here with Colin Edwards, who's looking just thrilled. Thrilled to be out of his parents' basement. Ready to play? Jump up. and Edwards finishes up the course with a fantastic time. Odd. He thrives in daylight, Johnny. It's the vitamin E. The Eliminator round is coming up after the break. Say hello to the dreaded sweeper. Yeah, bad for them. Great for us. Let's go to the third member of our team, Jill Wagner, who's with our contestant now. Jump up when you're ready to begin.
Let's take a peek at what the bruise ball has for our players. Kid stuff, Johnny, kid stuff. Just like baseball, bruise ball has four bases. Contestants must pass each base and make it to home plate in order to win. They must run down the first base line, pass the mound, and make it to first base. All the while, though, they have to avoid the swinging bruise ball bats. Once safely on the base, they'll have to make it to second along our bouncing base path. To get to third, they'll have to take a walk down the slide walk. And to score a run, they have to dive head first and touch home plate. And the third member of our team, Jill Wagner, is down on the sideline. When you're ready to start, jump. up the course with a fantastic time. Odd. He thrives in daylight, Johnny. It's the vitamin E. Coming up, the moment we've all been waiting for, the wipeout zone. Let's see where our contestants will be battling it out in our wipeout zone. No doubt in a wonderful, magical place, Johnny. Say hello to the spiked whackers. And be polite or they will flip out. Here's a little something we call the piston punch. It hits first and asks questions later. Let's go to the third member of our team, Jill Wagner, who's with our contestant now. Ready to play? Jump up. <laughs> Spike wagon. That's what they're there for, Johnny. full of sadness. He's also full of surprises. Colin Edwards has won. Now that he's got $50,000, he can finally pay to publish his book of sad poems. Another epic game of Pratt Falls and missteps. Or, as I like to call it, another day at the office. Alongside John Anderson and Jill Wagner, I'm John Henson saying good night and big balls. Hello, America, and welcome to a new edition of Wipeout. They'll try to... Hello, everybody, and welcome to Wipeout. It's time for people to get punched, hit, and smashed. And that's just in the green room. Now it's time to check out our qualifier. I'm ready, but I'm not sure our contestants are. This is the door knock. Everybody's favorite giant hammer behind every door. Welcome to the sucker punch. We got the suckers, and the wall provides the punch. Here we have the big balls with a twist. This time, contestants will be motivated by the dread mill. And the third member of our team, Jill Wagner, is down on the sideline. We welcome to Wipeout, Billy Chinstrap. He's excited to be here and looking forward to belly sliding his way to victory. When you're ready to start, jump.
right to the head. <laughs> I'm sorry, is it wrong to laugh? Check this out. Oops. That was straight to the legs. Our course doesn't discriminate, John. Our contestant cannot be liking this. But luckily for me, I do. Does everybody have this much fun at work, or just me? Our player heads straight into the water. Have a drink. It's on us. Does everybody have this much fun at work, or just me? Down into the drink. Enjoy it. I know we will. Grabs himself just an average time, but still looking fresh. Bird is still the word. Coming up next, the eliminator round. Say hello to the dreaded sweeper. Yeah, bad for them. Great for us. Our contestant is at the top of the course and ready to go. So let's check in with Jill and get the scoop. Jump up when you're ready to begin. Let's take a peek at what the bruise ball has for our players. Kid stuff, Johnny, kid stuff. 
Just like baseball, bruise ball has four bases. Contestants must pass each base and make it to home plate in order to win. They must run down the first base line, pass the mound, and make it to first base. All the while, though, they have to avoid the swinging bruise ball bats. Once safely on the base, they'll have to make it to second along our bouncing base path. To get to third, they'll have to take a walk down the slide walk. And to score a run, they have to dive head first and touch home plate. Let's go to the third member of our team, Jill Wagner, who's with our contestant now. Jump up when you're ready to begin. One more ring here, Johnny. Ring. Collectible. Makes sense. Almost made it to third base. Slidewalk takes down yet another one, Johnny. Almost made it to third base. Slidewalk takes down yet another one, Johnny. Almost made it to third base. Slidewalk takes down yet another one, Johnny. Our contestant grabs the ring. Nice work. Keep doing what you're doing, friend. Wow, an amazing time for Billy Chinstrap. And his competition has got to be feeling the chill. Down to their final moment, contestants will now face the wipeout zone. Let's see where our contestants will be battling it out in our wipeout zone. No doubt in a wonderful, magical place, Johnny. Say hello to the Mega Big Balls. Just like the original Big Balls, except with more real wipeout action. This is the crankshaft. All those arms aren't for hugging, Johnny. Adding to today's carnival is the spin-out. You must be this tall to ride this ride. Let's see what Jill Wagner's up to down on the course. When you're ready to start, jump. Another successful taken down by the piston punch. All cylinders are fired on that wipeout, Johnny. Flightless friend gets an excellent time. This course gives him wings, Johnny. I'm with the winner of our little game, Billy Chinstrap. He waddled his way straight into the $50,000 prize and straight into our hearts. A lot of bruised egos out there. And one satisfied winner. Thanks for joining us, friends. I'm John Henson saying good night and big balls.